In this video, I will show you how to install Proximity Voice Chat on your Aterno server. Proximity Voice Chat allows you to talk to friends without the need of installing any third-party applications. Now you will need to go to your Aterno server website. Here you can edit basically anything related to your server. And the first thing that we will need to change is the software. We locate the software section right here and we navigate over to the change button and we press it. Then we either choose paper bucket or spigot bucket. Go for either one of them, both of them do the job. And here you will need to choose your version. For the version, just get the latest one. After we have done that, we navigate to the install button and we press it. After the software has been installed, we navigate to the left and we go over to the plugins section. Then we go over to the search bar and we press it. Then we write open voice and we press the search button. Then you will see this plugin right here. You open it up. Now you will need to install the latest version, which is always located at the top. To install this version, you just navigate to the right and press this button right here. After you have installed it, you go over to your server section on the left and you start up your server. Then you will need to accept the Minecraft EULA. If you accept it, you press this button right here. The next step that you will need to do is launch Minecraft. Now I select the latest release by clicking this button and selecting latest release, the same as I did when I set up my Eterna server. Now we just press the play button. And now after you have entered Minecraft, you will need to press the multiplayer button right here and add your server. You press the add server button, you will need to go back to the Eterna's website. Now that we are on the website, we press the connect button, we take the IP at the top, we paste it inside of Minecraft and then at the end we add a colon. Then we go back to the website, we take the port, we select it and copy it, and now we just paste it in the IP and we press done. We press this button to join our server. Now we will need to minimize Minecraft and go back to the Eternus website where we will need to give special permissions to ourselves and to the friends that plan to use the proximity voice chat. After you have gotten here, you go over to the console option on the left, after you have gotten inside of the console, you need to press near this arrow and then write slash op and your username. For me, it's aeroxys and this gives me the server operator permissions. You will also need to do this for any of your friends that plan to use this plugin or the proximity voice chat. Just write slash op and their Minecraft username. After you have done that, you can go back to Minecraft, press back to game, and in here, press the T button to open up the chat again, and now write slash OA accept. And as you can see, it successfully worked. Next up, we will need to click here. We press this button, and you press yes. After you have done that, you press start audio session when you get redirected to this website, and then you press join voice chat. Now, you will be asked to allow your microphone. For this to work, you will need to press allow. And you have successfully created a voice chat room. And other players can join this channel when they join your server and they write OA accept. Once you are inside of the voice server, you can minimize your browser and go back to the game. To leave the voice chat server, you just close off the website. That is it for this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.